So we are at third cave camp at about 3,950 metres. Uh, and it's lovely and peaceful. It was campsite yesterday was Simba was crowded, but here there's only one other group over there. Um, otherwise it's just us. Um, and we've got Kibo rising up above us. You can see a tiny little bit of glass here on top of it. Um, and this is our tent. It's about eight o'clock in the morning and Adita there is having tea. And I think rest day today, we're just gonna go up there 100 meters to acclimatize and maybe look out somewhere over there is Moenzi. Kilimanjaro's second peak, so we'll just go and take a look at that today. And now we are having porridge and tea underneath Kibo. This is nice, we've got a nice outdoor spot. So I've come down the slopes a bit from third cave camp. I'm at about 3,900 metres um, looking up at Kibo. Um, now, I'm no geologist, um, but these rocks, and this, this could be, if I look further down the slope here, this could be a dry riverbed, but I'm thinking this looks like the moraine of once I've been a glacier. Um, and these, these smooth slabs here are, you know, they're kind of glacier scoured. So, so this is at 3,900 metres, so um, at some point in the probably not too distant past, um, there would have been a glacier here. And these, believe it or not, at 4,000 metres, are the prints of buffalo. Right up here, beneath Kibo. meters above third cave camp. That's Kibo, but that's not what we came to see. We climbed a little ridge just above camp. It's more of a, this, is, this is the saddle, I think, between Kibo and that mountain there, Moenzi in Cloud. That's the third highest mountain in Africa, if you count it as a separate mountain, 5149 meters. A uh, bit of a rock climb, and as you can see, the clouds are coming up from below. Uh, pretty soon they will cover it. I'm up here with Adita and Joseph. <laughs> now we've, we've come up a little bit higher, almost to the col, really, between the two peaks. So Moenzi's still there in cloud. Uh, over here, Kibo, we can actually see some people coming down. If you look at the left of the cone, uh, there's a there's a bump at the end of the ridge. That is Gilman's Point, and then you can see. Uh, let's see if I can zoom in a bit. So that that is Gilman's Point, and the, the grey streak coming down from it—that's the trail. And then uh, over here somewhere are Kibo Kibo Huts, and they're at 4,700 metres, and we'll be there tomorrow night. Uh, and we'll climb up to the crater from there, up that trail. And somebody's somebody's got a romantic gesture planned for his girlfriend. He's got the porters to come up and put a little notice there in the in the rocks. Will you marry me? It said uh, four thousand five hundred. He could have could have gone up to the summit. It's in cloud now, and. And it's a romantic gesture there, but some people just just don't know how to do it properly, do they? 